When Chris Jericho put you over clean at the Fatal 4-Way pay-per-view in 2010, and did a good job, I believe, uh, why do you think so little was done to capitalize on it? Was it the wellness violations? I'm not sure if they had happened yet at this point. Just plain backstage politics or some other reason? Just we were just a it was just a background role. I, there wasn't a huge story behind it, and it didn't get a lot of TV going into it. What it was was just a fun match for the fans to see. Um, and, but you know, I, I thought it was awesome. I love working with Jericho. I can't think of uh, basically the two best matches I had with WWE. What, one was against well Ray Chavo and uh, Jericho. Those are my three best matches, and those <laughs> those guys were awesome. Yeah, Jericho was so cool, man. He's easy to work with. Uh, he's just one of those guys, man, he's, he's so smart. He just really knows what he's doing in the ring, outside the ring. I, I really admire, like, if I could be more like Jericho, I'd be happier with myself. And just in terms of his true motivation, his, his attitude, and his approach to life, I mean, he doesn't do anything half-assed. This guy bangs it out of the park. Everything he does, no matter what he goes into, he just gets good at it. It's, uh... It's very admirable. That's a loving tribute. So you're basically asking about my time working with Jericho and Edge? Like backstage, like they seem to support you and give you the pin oh. calls. Like I just the, feel like they're rooting for you. Yeah, I mean, those are two of the good guys. I mean, they're like, they are, they are like guys that make the wrestling business so, such a good place to be. Like they're veterans who set this awesome, uh, they said they set a mood in the locker room of like lighthearted fun work hard help each other like those are two guys that always were like light like lighthearted easy to easy to talk to easy to approach jericho would walk into a locker room like especially on tuesdays we'd be cooked from working friday saturday sunday monday tuesday we drove there we're tired it's you know we're, we're just waiting around waiting around for the show Jericho will walk in there and light up the locker room just like, hey, everybody, get off your asses. Let's have some fun. Like, let's do it. Like, he, like, he, uh, he, he's like a cheerful person to be around. He raises everybody's spirits. And um, he, he's like, I'm so glad that he's back in the locker room right now just for the guys that are there, just so that they can deal with uh, a guy like Jericho who, you know, I had some of my best matches against while I was in WWE. And uh, I had some really good tag matches against Edge. And I had a lot of fun working with him. He was one of those guys that was like, he just, they treated you like a peer from the start. Uh, they're super respectful of guys who owe them a mounds of respect. And I, that's, a, that's a good way to be. They're cool guys. Uh, so I was very, very fortunate to work with them in 2010.